Look, it's a basic issue of fairness. Should people really be able to earn more than £26,000 just through benefits alone? I don't believe that they should, and I think the overwhelming majority of people in this country would back that view. To have that sort of money, £26,000, someone uh, would have to earn £35,000. That is a good and healthy salary. So I think it's a basic issue of fairness. It's time to call time on these excessive welfare payouts, and that's what the benefit cap will do. I don't think it will adversely affect uh, large families. We'll be able to work through each of these cases. In many cases, the answer will be for someone in that family to go out and work, and that will be the right answer for that family. We have too many children growing up in our country in households where nobody works, where a life on welfare has become an acceptable uh, alternative. That key is to make sure that we help families into work, and therefore they're not so reliant on welfare. And part of that is a welfare cap. The criticism I get for many people is that £26,000 is too much. I think £26,000 is the right level. As I've said, you have to earn £35,000. That's a salary far higher than the average salary in our country. So I think this is a fair measure that the British public will support. The idea that, as we have at the moment, some people, particularly in the London area, getting housing benefit of £20,000, £30,000 a year, living in houses that the people who are paying their taxes to pay for that housing benefit couldn't themselves afford, I think is wrong. So it's time for some basic fairness and a welfare cap at £26,000 I think is fair.